and I think my backpack is all packed for the first day of school. Okay, I have to make sure I have everything I need in here. Okay, I have all of my school supplies in here, and I might as well bring a few things for entertainment purposes, such as a DVD player and some books. I think I should bring some books too. Alright girls, have you packed your backpacks for for the first day of school tomorrow? Yes I have. Same. Alright, that's great. And of course, don't forget to set your alarm clock. Oh, thanks for reminding me. And of course, I can tell you girls are also packed for your first day of school tomorrow. I'm gonna Skype Skylar and see what she's doing. Hello, Skylar. Oh, hey, Skipper. Guess what tomorrow is? Yes, I know. It's the first day of school. Yep. And that also means that we're gonna spend more time with each other and not on vacation or anything like that. But wait, what about Claire? Oh crap, I forgot about her. Wait, are you two talking about Claire? Yep. I hate her too, like, she, she seriously picks on everyone that isn't like her. She just picks on pretty much everyone else at the school. Except maybe her few friends. Well, if we see her at school tomorrow, she is going down hard. Oh yeah. I'm, I'm on board with this plan to beat her up. Screw you, Claire. Nobody likes her. And it's pretty ironic that she calls everyone else pretty much idiots when she herself is the idiot of the school. So anyways, where are we gonna meet up at tomorrow? Well, I was thinking we should probably meet up towards the front of the school like we pretty much always do. Alright, that sounds like a good idea. Skylar, you have to start getting ready for bed now. Oh man. Well, anyways, I'll see you at school tomorrow. Because, you know, my mom is forcing me to get ready for bed. I can't even believe it's this late already. Anyways, I'm gonna log off the computer. I might as well log off of mine too. Alright girls, since you two have a very busy day tomorrow, as well as Chelsea and Kelly, you girls should really start getting ready for bed. Okay, finally, I can wash my face and prevent acne. Hey, Chrissy. Sleep tight, little one. And then they lived happily ever after the end. Good night, girls. See you two in the morning. Good night, Barbie. Good night, Barbie. Good night, girls. I'll see you in the morning. When it's time to wake up to get ready for school. Okay, I'm all dressed for today.
Good morning, girls. Good morning, party. Good morning, Barbie. I can see you girls are already up. Now it's time to get ready for the first day of S-C-H-O-O-L. I can't wait to see my friends again and try on my new outfit. Same. Although, of course, school's gonna be boring for me, but oh well, at least I can see my friends. Alright girls, it's time to get up! Today is the first day of school, you don't want to be late. Cuter than I thought he would in this outfit. Oh yeah, I look cool in this. Can't wait to show this off to my friend. Whatever. Okay, it's time for a back to school picture before you girls come downstairs for breakfast. Say cheese. 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 And now it's time to go downstairs for breakfast. Blah, 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 blah. A few minutes later. Alright girls, now it's time to grab your backpacks and get on the car. Got my backpack, got everything I need on it, got my cell phone. I think I should be good to go. Alright, so I have my backpack. I think I should take my skateboard too. There we go. Alright, let's get our backpacks on. And let's go downstairs and walk to the car. Ready for me. Okay, I think we're ready to start heading to the car. Last one of the car is a rotten egg. There you girls are. And as always, I call shotgun. <laughs> Looks like you're the rotten egg, Chelsea. Shut up, Stacy. But it's true. Bye Barbie, bye, bye Skipper, bye Stacy. See you in the afternoon. Bye Chelsea, bye Barbie, I'll see you later. Just like, you know, don't get into to any trouble today because it's the first day of school. I won't. And of course, we're here at the preschool. Gotta get you out of your car seat. I also have to get Chrissy out of her car seat. Alright Kelly, let's walk to your preschool class. I'm excited to learn some new things and see my friends again. 
a few minutes later. And I am home. As well as Chrissy. Just the two of us. You got to swing in your swing and I got to watch TV. I wonder how Skipper, Stacy, Chelsea, and Kelly are doing on their first day of uh, back to school. So we're here at school again. Yep. By the way, I've noticed how we match. Oh my god, I realized that too. So anyways, I've noticed we're here kind of early this morning. Oh yeah, it's 7.50 and school doesn't start until 8 o'clock. Oh, hello, Norma. Oh, hey there, Skipper, Skylar, and Stacy. I just arrived at school. <laughs> yeah, we can tell. It's the first day and coincidentally, Stacy and I kind of match. Look. Oh yeah, I see. Yeah, your outfits are similar. A few minutes later. Well, well, well. What do we have here? Four dorks talking to each other. Claire, we're all sick and tired of your crap. And we're not going to take any more of your bullying or your stupidity. You're going down, Claire. Because when we're all done with you, you're gonna be in the history books. What exactly do you four losers mean by that? Hey, what's going on? Am I gonna get beaten up or something? Dang right you are. We all hate you, Claire. Yeah. And today is the day you're gonna get exactly what you deserve. We all have you trapped in the circle. Yeah, we all hate you. That pretty much everyone at the school does. Except the other actual losers here. Hey look everyone, there's gonna be a school fight! Fight, 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 fight! A few more minutes later. Okay, so we got the bully problem taken care of, and it's time for our homeroom class because for some reason our school has to be that weird. Instead of making us go to first period on the first day of school, we have to go to like a certain designated room on our, our printed out bell schedule. Wait for me you guys! I think our class should be this way. Yes, it's finally lunchtime! Oh, uh, finally. I was so bored of having to hear the teacher say some random crap about how today is the first day of school, how we have to introduce ourselves, and all that first day of school sort of stuff. So, what did everyone bring for lunch today? I bought a sandwich, some strawberries, and a Capri Sun. I have a Capri Sun, some salad, and also a sandwich. I have an orange, a Capri Sun, and, and a baked potato. Wow, you lamos all bought Capri Suns to school. I have this hug juice barrel right here. So I'm technically different from you guys. A few minutes later. I forgot how terrible this tastes. I want to throw it at someone. Hmm. Who can I throw this at? Wait a minute. I think I'll throw it at Derek. At the table across from us. Blah, 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 blah. 
One, two, three. What the? Son, you just got hugged. Well, in that case, food fight! You heard him. We're having a food fight, everyone. Uh, Darcy, I don't think that was the best idea. Yeah, but hey, at least school got a lot more interesting. I agree with Tamika, this was a terrible idea. But it was worth it. Uh, Darcy, you're the one who started this. Still beats having to listen to the boring old teacher a bunch of times. Well, yeah, I guess that is true. Hmm, I like your drawing, Malicia. Thanks, Yelly. You're welcome. Maybe I can play at your house on Saturday. That's a good idea. Later that day. So, how was school today? It was mostly easy, and Stacy and I, as well as some of, our, some of our friends and some kids we didn't even know, took down Claire Johnson, the biggest jerk at, at our school. Let's just say she won't be picking on us again. Darcy threw a hug juice barrel at Derek. And she came up with the funniest punchline ever after after it hit Derek, and he was like, what the? I had an awesome gift. Dorothy Hey. I got to see all my friends play. Wow. Today, wow, I guess the first day of school can be interesting. After all. And since you girls have all behaved today, you girls all get some ice cream! Yay! Yay! Well, girls, since you've defeated that awful jerk, Claire, I thought I'd reward you girls with some ice cream. Cause even I hate Claire Johnson. She truly is a jerk to everyone. And Stacy? Yes? Barbie? In a few hours, you have your orthodontist appointment. I just remembered that today. Oh man. What do you mean I have to get my wires replaced? And I have to have my teeth be uncomfortable and sore for a few days. I really hope I got these braces off soon. But yeah, that is all, folks. Until next time, bye-bye! Epilogue Oh yeah, I almost forgot it was all- it was that time of the month again. And what I mean by that is, it's that time of the month to see my orthodontist again. Rubber bands? What do you mean I have to wear rubber bands every day? And not every night. Ow, well this sucks. Huh. I just want to go home and go to bed. Instead of having to deal with this pain. And unnecessary torture. And that is truly the end of this video. Bye bye everyone.